Hello everyone, Sigmalator here. Welcome back to Mass Effect Andromeda. Hey Cora. Guarding the Tempest. The Nomad got some attention when we disembarked, and it's a lot more portable. Seems smart. Only three attempts to steal it so far, and one offer to buy it. What was the offer? Just so I know how much I'm driving around. Negotiations fell apart when he asked if I came with the car. Weird. <laughs> Must have been something I aimed. <laughs> That's Lots fun. of activity. Nothing suspicious. Uh, not the tempest. Down to the slums. Yeah, loadout confirmed. That'll do. Let's go finish up Kadara, and then we can move on to bigger and grander things. We're closer to finding the Asari Ark. There's some Krogan stuff to sort out still. We are a fair ways off from finish being finished here. Right. Oh, you. Sila, I've got a message from Jim, your boyfriend. Got it. Don't tell me he really thinks I'm his girlfriend. Hopeful thinking on his part? More than hopeful. Delusional. Go on then. What's the message? He said he'll have enough credits to pay Sloan's protection fees wow. soon. And, uh, to wait for him. <laughs> I'll set him straight. Ugh, what a pain. It is. Alright. Uh, whoops. Poor Jim. You love sick little pup. Right, let's head on back outside. We'll come back to Jim later. There we go. Right. So we've got firefighters over there. Ket on Kadara. Meeting spot at Spirit's Ledge. So where's this point we're supposed to go to find that Salarian's guy? Or is that off-world? Anyway, first point, let's go over here. No thanks. Not getting distracted. Oops. All right, you are properly up in the mountains. Well, at least it's easier to climb these mountains than in uh, Mass Effect 1. Yeah. 
Hey, the guy. This must be the hideout of those hackers who attacked Sam. Everyone remember, these people think their virus worked. Sam's gone, and I'm on their side. This'll be good. Private channel only once we're in, Sam. All right, let's go see if we can set these people straight. Welcome to our sanctuary. I'm Catherine Nye, Knight to my colleagues. I wrote the virus that freed you from Sam. I don't know how to thank you. I'm sorry your father did this. The initiative's use of AI could doom us all, and you were the first to suffer. Did your virus kill Sam? Sam has been reduced. It's harmless now. I saw the folly of merging humans and AI in the Milky Way, a black ops project called Overlord that created a monster. Many died, my son was hurt, and the young man used as a host was consumed. Every Pathfinder risks the same fate. That can happen? I've never heard of Overlord. I guess your father hadn't either. Excuse me, I have work to do, unless you have questions. If you're afraid of AI, why join an organization that uses it? We needed an escape. I thought the initiative was using shackled AI for research. When I understood it... Well, a firefighter doesn't run away from a fire. What more can you tell me about Project Overlord? A black ops experiment by mad scientists to merge a human mind with synthetic intelligence. Their creation was a horror. I paid a heavy price to get my son out. You think the Pathfinders could be overcome by their AI? Worse. If the Initiative thinks the human AI merge works, they might roll it out to everyone. Imagine Sam's power in the hands of people who weren't ready for it. I shouldn't keep you. Thank you. Don't worry about Sam reconnecting. Our AI detector is always watching. That's good to know. The virus was a beginning. I'm about to make sure the Initiative never repeats its mistake. I see. Pathfinder, it's unlikely an AI detector could discern our private channel. However, this may not be true for your scanner. Knight's planning something big. That's not good. She's dangerous. Let's find out what's up. Discreetly. Ah, my scanner tripped the AI detector. I can mask this as an error, but future pings might draw attention. Maybe there's... Hey. There's another way to find out what Knight's planning, if she gives us enough time. Blueprints for the computer network on the Nexus. So we don't know what she's planning, but we know where. Alright, okay, so I need to be careful, can't really... Looks like Knight's personal console. Sam, can you get into it? Yes, but my access will trigger the AI detector. You'll only have one chance. Okay. Let's wait until we know what we're looking for. Uh, thank you for Elisa data. It's so obvious when you run a comparison. The GEF, the SAMs, all our data shows that working AI produce a, a detectable electromagnetic pattern similar to brain activity in organic life. Different cases, but a distinct signature. I even tested it against a basic VI. They're not even close. So blathering aside, the answer is yes. We but we, all we need is sensors that pick up the EM pattern of an AI operating nearby. Uh, interfacing with a Pathfinder implant and we've got a detector. Child's play. How's your virus coming along? Yeah, I know. We're not going to look at that yet. Bloody fly. Right. No comments on any of this so far? Alright. Lost fly. Hello. Oh, welcome. I'm Laveria. I'm so glad Knight's virus worked. Do you need anything? It sounds like Knight is taking all this to the next level. Oh yes, very soon now. Has she told you anything? Not much. Alain, her son, would know more. 
Why did you join Knight's movement? <laughs> I know. Me, an underground hacker? Back home, I was a concierge on the Citadel. I coded games for my little sisters. They played together, walked to school together. And when those Geth machines attacked the Citadel, the Geth impaled them on spikes. Together. Oh, crap. That's horrible. That's why I left for Andromeda, and why I joined Knight. It's a relief to be free, but Sam wasn't so bad. Each AI is different. None of the Geth who attacked the Citadel stopped the others from hurting my little sisters. I'm sorry. Sam would have been sorry, too. Really? You would? Well, thank you. See you later, Laveria. Bye. Come by any time. <sighs> this must be tough to hear, Sam. Those AI are the product of a different civilization. Ours will be founded on organic, synthetic partnership. I bridge the hard-earned lessons of the past and the promise of the future. Yeah, you do, Sam. Anything in here apart from her son? No. It. You must be Ryder, Alain. My mother's in charge around here. But you're a celebrity. Sorry, I can't show you around. I'm stuck sitting here for a few more hours. Is something wrong? I'm fine. Just good old Project Overlord. Still kicking me when I'm down. When Mom has... Nope. Can't talk about that. Do you need anything? Anything you can tell me about Project Overlord? Black Ops guys trying to make a VI-human hybrid. They hired my mother as a programmer. They told me I was a candidate for the human part. And, hey, not like my body was doing me any favors. But my implants got hacked, and Mum said we're leaving. Lucky me. Overlord went downhill fast. If it's all right, can I ask you why you need all these machines? I had a serious infection in my nervous system. I use spinal implants to walk and, you know, bathroom stuff. But while my mother was working on Project Overlord, my implants got hacked. They still work. I just have to sink them a few hours a day. Damn. Your mother seems to have plans. Mum's always got plans. A big one's coming up. Nothing else you can tell me? I would. But you just arrived. I learned the hard way. Trust has to be earned. I've got to go. You know where I'll be. Pathfinder, I believe we can fix Alain's implants. I have schematics for an appropriate device. It will require time and resources. Or I could start scanning, but that's risky. Build a curative device for Elaine at a research centre. Right. The AI detector picked up a scan. That'll be hard to explain away. I haven't scanned anything. Where is the research center? Is there one up here? No, that's her console. Don't want to activate that yet. The research centers here. Or was that just him? Okay, let's go. I might have to come back. No, it doesn't look like I can get in there. Okay, 
No going in there. Because I think optional scan the sanctuary for clues, build a curative device. Right, yeah, I'll have to come back then for that one. Oh, what are you? Ah, lithium. I need platinum for my armor. Right, that's on hold for now then. Less. Can I do research stuff at one of these? I don't think I can. Let's have a look. No doubt. No doubt. No, okay, so can't do research stuff here. Fair enough. Natural settlement site, not going to do that yet. Right, let's go over here. We're too late. Let's look around. Maybe see you left something behind. Think I found something. Looks like a wire. Ah, uh, here we go. Console. What's that? Examine the dead drop. Ah, uh, our good old friend, the Fiend. Right, guys, don't shoot it's it. It's open. Reyes, I found a data pad with what looks like a nav point. Must be where Zia's hiding the cargo. Probably left that behind for the buyer. Whatever happened to just going to a store? Sloan takes a cut from all official sales in Kadara. Gotta get creative if you want to go around that. Did you find anything on your end? The Salarian is a fence. No direct connection to the collective. My guess is Zia met him to find potential buyers. Let's follow up on those coordinates. I'll meet you there. All right, good. You ignored the fiend. See guys, you don't need to start a fight with every monster or beastie in the land. What's that there? Are you platinum? I would like some platinum. Ugh, boo, lithium. All right. Oh. Oh, we'll just fast travel, that'll make life much easier. A shuttle could be Zia's. <laughs> There we go.
Hostiles ahead. Where? Oh, hey, Reyes. It's empty. What if this was all just some elaborate trick to get you here? You mean, there was never any cargo? Bravo. I knew you'd figure it out eventually. Zia. You could never resist the big payout. What can I say? I'm a greedy man. That's why you don't have any friends. You're selfish. Skip the small talk. Why'd you lure Reyes here? He's been taking all the good jobs in Kadara. It's gotten more than my attention. So what? The local smuggling union got together and decided to take me down? Something like that. Ah, oh, shit. Move in. Not today. All right, there we go. See if there's anything. Worth collecting. There's something down here you want me to scan? I've already scanned that. Oops. No, oh, nothing else hit. wasn't popular, but I never thought the other smugglers would team up against me. Kind of flattering, actually. <laughs> they might try again. Undoubtedly. But it's harder to kill a man who knows you're gunning for him. Ah, all that effort and no credits to show for it. There are a few less smugglers in Kadara. Think of it as thinning out the competition. You and your silver linings, Pathfinder. Hmm. I should clean up this mess. Zia was a piece of work, but it feels wrong to leave her out in the open. Oh, I will leave you to it. I'll take care of this. All right. I went to open the door. Not necessarily talk to you again. No offense. All right. That's taken care of. Okay, let's pop over here then and see what this malarkey is all about. Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Cheers. Uh, Alright, go completely the wrong way. So let's fast travel over here.
That seems uh, easier. Uh, don't worry, Jarl. You'll you'll get the hand of uh, the hand of uh, sarcasm eventually. Looks like a crash. Aftermath of an attack. Looks bad. Is that you? Don't talk. We'll get you back to town. No, I can't move. It, it's too late. I just want to rest. Don't lose hope, brother. Can you tell me what happened? It, it was the cat. Took us by surprise. They killed everyone. John lasted the longest. They didn't know I was still alive. I saw them raiding our packs. Then they... They took off into the hills. What's in the hills? Is there a kept base there? There's nothing in the hills. I don't... We've never heard of a base. Sloan says Kadara is free of Ket. <laughs> what did the Ket take from you? I... I don't know. Supplies. Weapons. Scavenged ship parts. I'll leave you to rest. Thank you. I... I wish... Kytus, it's Ryder. Your cat rumors have weight. Just found a caravan they attacked. Damn it. Really thought we got them all. One of the wounded said they headed for the hills. I'm gonna check it out. I'll search too. Grabbing a shuttle now. Okay, they're back this way. Hello? Mm, what's this? Cat tracks. They're leading up into those hills. All right, let's give me one of those. How far away is that? No. Oh, I'll take some iridium. Why not? Not platinum, though. Really? That's it. Looks like those exiles stole tech from the port. Cat tracks. We're going the right way. And you're this way. Tracks can't be far now. Mm 
All right, let's see what the, this lot are up to. Hey. Another one of these, or maybe not. All right. Out in that cave. Kytus, I think I found something. Sending the nav point. There we go. I knew we we'd be exploring the caves at some point. Impatient, are we? Sloan, I wasn't expecting you. She wouldn't take no for an answer. I'm not about to let someone else fight my battles. Especially an initiative lapdog. You were happy enough to have this lapdog track down information for you? That's what dogs do. Fetch. Enough. Let's get this over with. You're such a grump when you're worried. Every second you're gone from the port is an opportunity for the Collective. Pathfinder and I can have it. What was that? They know we're here. Get ready. I don't like you, Sloane. Oh, whoops. Come on. This isn't my first radio, Sloan. cave a bit. Uh, lithium. Alright. Ooh, what's up here? Nothing, apart from some iridium. Alright, I think we're done here.
think that's the last of them. Let's get rid of the bodies. I'll leave you to it. Manual labor isn't my thing. <sighs> of course it's not. <laughs> the Tempest. So very much. And I agree, manual labour not my thing either. I hear some shooting going on nearby. Right. What are we doing? Okay, so need to sort that lot out, but I need a research centre. And looks like the only way I'm going to get that is either by setting down an outpost or turning to the Kadara port. So let's go back to the port, research the thing we need, fix up uh, Alan, is that his name? And then see if we can bring that story to a close. Nomad cannot be called it. Well, it's here, so that's a lie. Ooh, pretty. Oh, I think there's a research centre right at the top of this lift, isn't there? On the port. How very convenient. Yep, there we go. Uh, development. Main traps done. Liam's armor requisition. Cybernetic device. Let's craft that. We'll do that for Liam. Yep, so I don't have any platinum. All right. Pathfinder, you've got missed calls on the Tempest. Check back when you've got a minute. All right. Missed calls, eh? Wasn't aware that was a function. Finder. You've got missed calls on the Tempest. I know. You've got a minute? Yeah, you've already told me, Suvi. If I'm back in time, maybe we'll get it done then. Okay. So, let's... Fast travel here. Oh, good. Hello? I put a little something together. This should help fix your implants. 
Are you serious? Yeah. Yeah, I can feel my nerves waking up. When Mercury goes down, Mum will lose her mind over this. Thank you. No problem, Alain. Mercury. I've got to go. Thank you again. Mercury. Sounds like a code name for whatever Knight's doing. This will enable me to find any relevant data quickly. Let's search Knight's console and see what she's up to. Security protocols breached. Bring up anything tagged Mercury. Files found. Mercury. A strike to prevent any future AI by destroying all quantum computers on the Nexus. Damn it. You could use those computers to create AI, but right now they run half the station. A lot of people could die. We need to stop, Knight. Now. Pathfinder, the AI detector has been triggered. Hostiles approaching. We were trying to help you! Now you see... Don't give me help I didn't specifically ask for. It's a schematic for a blue box? A quantum computer. They serve several purposes, including creating AI. A military-grade EMP device, normally used to damage electrical equipment. Right, there's one. <laughs> EMP devices, commons area. Oh, hang on. I'm guessing that is... They must be on the ne on the Nexus. That area's locked off. All right. Yeah, so head back to Nexus to finish that off. Is there anything else here? I don't think there is. Yeah, I can't see that nav point the other, that other dude sent me. Alright, let's head back to the Nexus. And get this wrapped up. Oh, and I have missed calls to take care of. It's all go for me today, Jesus. Gills, ready to talk to you about the Ket transmitter? You have new email at your terminal, Pathfinder. Pathfinder. Uh, I should get back to things. Sounds good. Mr. Calls? Call me. Res Ryder, something interesting just fell into my lap. Call me when you have a minute. Okay, cool. I don't believe it. Gills reconfigured our entire nav array. O'Connell risked a dozen spacewalks putting that in place. Damn it. Callow, don't. Take the helm. I've had enough of this. Oh dear. Here we go. You don't give a damn what my team and I went through to build this ship. No, I don't. I care about us surviving out here, and if that means redesigning. You don't have the right.
Knock it off, both of you. Sure. Once he gets off my back about how I work on the Tempest. You weren't here. We had to get all kinds of new tech working in a single starship. Fifty hour shifts, epiphanies, accidents. Humans can forget. Salarians can't. To me, it's all still happening. My team is here. Stripping down the Tempest like some broken radio risks everything they suffered to build. Their legacy. I could see how you'd feel that way. Seriously? Look, Callow, your people did a great job, but they're dead. And they couldn't have anticipated half the problems in Helios. Like the Scourge. If we don't adapt, we'll die too. Is that what you want their legacy to be? Gutting a complex ship out in space isn't adapting. It's irresponsible and disrespectful. The Tempest is ours now. She has to serve our mission first in whatever capacity we need. Gil, change whatever you have to. I wonder, in time, will strangers be treating your achievements so carelessly? <sighs> Peace and quiet, finally. Thanks, Ryder. I mean, Gil's right. Okay, show's over. Back to it. Gil is right. Right. <sighs> You have AVP outstanding, Pathfinder. Oh, excellent stuff. Strike teams, how are they doing? Yay! Alright. Back you up, go again. 78%. Oof. No, that's too low. Jesus. That's even lower. What the hell? Okay, I don't know what this lot is. But let's claim them all. That's it. That's the easy way to go about it. Oh, I can create... Right. Insufficient. Okay, I see. Right. I have another crow uh, thing, or do I? There we go. A foolish thing to get angry over, isn't it? I suppose the Tempest is just like any other ship. To be taken apart and put back together. Or she will be, once Gil's had his way. Gil's upgrading the Tempest, not scrapping her. She's in good hands. I wish I could believe you. But perhaps... <sighs> Anything else? If you helped to build the Tempest, you must know plenty about her. Just about everything. By memory, it was quite the effort to get her working. The Initiative needed absolutely up-to-date technology which we all had to coordinate, and some of it was rather tricky to acquire. Acquire? By, legally, and above board, of course. <clears throat> yes. Sadly, <laughs> the other Pathfinder vessels were lost when the Scourge hit the Nexus. The Tempest is truly unique. You know, I haven't actually met many Solarians. Careful. Depending who you ask, we're conniving spies, genius researchers, or meddling scientists. 
We have to pack a lot of living into 40 odd years. Everything gets accelerated, lines blur. I just hope we don't repeat our old mistakes out here. What do you think of the rest of the crew? Well, I can't talk about Suvi. She's sitting right there. I'm not listening. You can say whatever you like. <laughs> oh no, I'm not falling for that again. I'll let you concentrate. You know where I'll be. Yeah, and like most Larians, he's already dealt with uh, the issue. Right, let's head back to the Nexus then and get this finished. No orbiting Kadara. Oh, maybe not. <sighs> Mixed messages. Right, I don't see those... Those nav points on the thing, so maybe they'll appear later. But we'll head to the Nexus and then we'll have to end the episode here. That went on for a bit longer than I anticipated. Alright, here we go. Lost your connection to the Mass Effect server, you'll be unable to access online features. Uh, okay, fair enough. So my, has my internet died? Is that what you're telling me? Doesn't look like it. Phone still connected. Hub, hub is fine. Oh, we've got a few things to tidy up here as well. Okay, so next episode, episode we're going to be busy on the Nexus. I think I said this before. There is such a thing as too many side quests. It's just as well I enjoyed this game. <laughs> All right, here we are. This is Kandros. Sam warned us about Knight's attack. Unfortunately, one device triggered already. We lost a chunk of hydroponics. Sorry, Kandros. I had to help someone out. Where's Knight? We're tracking her down, but those devices are still alive. I need you to take care of them, quietly. We can't afford panic. Oh, so this is our time limit. Excellent. Oh, no. Only three, so maybe that one was going to go off regardless. But for now... Hmm. No, let's let's get these things done and th end on a high note. Son of a bitch, you played me. Knight? Yes, me. I let you near my son. You're not stopping this. If you find I am. There's number two. Ryder, please. The Nexus doesn't need those computers. But we won't be safe from another Overlord until they're gone. You don't know that. Yes, I do. I sacrificed everything to stop it. You didn't stop it. Commander Shepard did. Ryder, we 
cornered Knight, but she's carrying the last of those devices. I have a sniper ready, but she wants to speak to you. We could end this peacefully. All right, where is she? Shocking base. As sleepers wake from stasis, the initiative urgently requires blood, tissue, and DNA donations. See a medic if you think you may be eligible. This is Agent S. I can't wait. I don't know about these Angara. Andros reports the sniper is ready. Understood, Sam. Sam, such a human name. But you murdered my colleagues. God only knows what happened to my son. Nothing in you is human now. I dream. I bleed. I feel like you. I just have a little extra. Until Sam decides otherwise. I'm sorry. It won't let you see. But you're the beginning of the end. Oh shit. Ella, I'm sorry. Well, there's no way to save her. I guess Ella's going to be on a re revenge mission now. Anyway, now that that is over, I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch this, guys. If you liked it, like, subscribe, ding that bell. I've been Sigma later. This has been Mass Effect Andromeda, and I'll catch you next time. Take care now.